PGT Innovations is the nation's largest manufacturer of impact-resistant windows and doors. As we get into hurricane season, I went to their testing lab to see just how strong of a hurricane their products can withstand. Fire. PGT Innovations President and CEO Jeff Jackson says Florida has the most stringent building standards in the window and door industry. Given our a history of hurricane uh, hits and, and whatnot that's happened to our state, the devastations of those storms. The Florida legislature was very bright in passing on early codes that will protect our families, protect our homes. He and his team make sure PGT's products adhere to those codes, rewinding 26 years to Hurricane Andrew, where impact came to light. A lot of our products and technologies from that point, we worked with the codes and helped to make them stronger. Testing those products with a water test, cyclic test, and three missile impact test. Testing their products under Miami-Dade standards, stricter than the two protocols here on the Sun Coast. One is what's called a missile level C, which is a four and a half pound two by four traveling at 40 feet per second. That's going to be really common in like Tampa area, Hillsboro, Manatee and Bradenton. Heading to Sarasota and south, the requirement jumps to missile level D. And that's actually double the weight, a nine pound two by four, and it's traveling at a faster rate of speed. 25% faster at 50 feet per second. That's what we saw in the lab. Whether they buy our products or not, they need to be educated so that they understand what's at risk. It's their, sometimes their life savings, it's their family, it could be their animals, it could be any of those things. Make informed decisions about where to upgrade and where you're going to get the bang for your buck, not only from your insurance agency, but from a peace of mind and security uh, related standpoint. In Venice, Hallie Pilot, SNN, the Sun Coast News Network. More than 2,000 people work for PGT, making it one of the largest employers in Sarasota County.